guys, it has been a bit of time. I've had some time to relax and think what I wanted to do for the series. And I got it. If we go into here, have been a little bit busy. And I've got some farms to build. Iron farms, but some overkill ones, let's say. <laughs> Which, if I, even if I just render it in, my game almost crashes. Yeah. This thing is massive. Look at it. So we're definitely not doing that. And, and but and that one's still too far for us. So I saw this one by what else? I think that's how you pronounce it. Which it's quite simple. Just three villagers and a zombie. With a bit of water that. So I'm hoping that we can build it a bit further away from this area. Because you don't want them like racing with each other. I'm thinking maybe the either we build it that way of the house, which I'm not too sure is a good idea. Or we build it on top of that hill we found the um <laughs> found that flower forest type thing over here so i'm hoping we can go there because that, that looks like it could be quite nice so oh yeah i got some oh when i went down mining for some deep slates found a bit of diamond so i managed to get enough for pickaxe so I really just want to get silk touch on this. One and breaking. Okay, that's quite expensive. So let's see what what materials do we need? That one. Materials list. And there we go. So we need three beds, a bunch of Slate bunch of glass. The deep slate's easy enough. Got that. Need some more sand. And then the rest is just pretty standard. Let me trade some. Yeah, let me trade some sticks for emeralds to get a name tag for the zombie. And then we also need one for the stuff from kill chamber so that's lava water copper sides deep slate glass deep slate okay let me get that done and i'll be right back alrighty guys i decided let's rather build it closer because i don't feel like moving villagers far away and then at least it's loaded in here so we're going to be changing up a few things as we go but it's going to stay almost exactly the same to how how he designed it i'll put his link in the description if you want to go check him out please do but i think i need i don't have enough villagers actually so I'm going to see how that plans out for us. Right. Okay. Oh, it is very weird to board. So that chamber in the middle is where the zombies are going to go. The chambers with the bed are the villagers.
So there's going to be water here so the zombie will, won't move and will bob up and down. Temporary block, glass, glass. You don't have to add corners. I think it just makes it look nicer. There, there, there. Grab a torch. There. Break there. Right there. Right here. that one side then so yeah I'm gonna hold up these villager chambers and the zombie chamber bring the villagers over and get the zombie and then we'll build this top piece in the bottom and then let's get it done so enjoy the time lapse guys Alright guys, so you might have saw that we're only missing one part, the zombie. So, we only need one of you guys, so follow me. Let's just create a bit of space. Where's it? Where's he gone? Oh, they fell. Oh, of course they did. Why wouldn't they? Really thought he was going after the villager there. Oh no, no. Man. Everything's just going wrong. Let's so push him down. Then let's try this one more time. Okay, so materialize the villagers, bring him, block off, block off, all right. As well. Okay. Should have done this before I put the villages in. So I must go there, lock off, lock off. Alright. Now we just need you. You must just. Oh, and he's holding a block. Okay, here is going to be good. Come right up, sir.
I did call him some funny name. Let's eat up. Right there. Those two need to be replaced. That needs to be replaced. Okay. That as well. Everything is just falling apart. Okay, no blocks. Oh, there. It's those two blocks there. Let's just get that out of the way. And I believe just that. And if I do this quick enough, I'm going to break you. 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 Stay all be frightened. Let's hope that works. <laughs> okay guys let me check if it works okay guys it is working it's all coming in so i think let's start to the next part and I'm going to have to get the resources for it and probably a bit more iron but I know of a slime chunk not too far I remember when I was digging one of the caves a slime spawned so I marked the chunk so I'm going to look how you build one and let's get that done guys I've got a little problem I've got two options there's a slime chunk where I am over here and I believe oh that by the way um, yeah in this chunk but I don't know why but I want to build it in this this chunk I do think just having this here might affect it but who cares? So I'm gonna get some stained glass just so I can look through the ground at it. And then I'm gonna just fill in this area until the road. So it's a level and do what not and I'll then I'll start mining. Hey guys, so I've been busy. The iron farm has been working great. Got two stacks of iron and more there. And the slime farm, just draining out some of the blocks, has been working. And it's down there. I'll show it to you guys later. But I think that's it, guys. You've got an iron farm and a slime farm. Like the two most used things. Two of the most used things for redstone contraptions. And I do think with that iron farm. Oh yeah, don't worry, my tools are just sitting there. Just moving stuff around. It's a lot of work. You can sell all this iron. For emeralds. It's just passive income. It's perfect for what we want to do. 
So, I think that's where I'm going to end it off, guys. Our AFK between episodes. Just make sure that everything goes through the system. Not. So, yeah, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye now.